Got to do a recap of our February stocks right here. Yeah, we got to do a recap on them to see how we're doing on these swing trades. So uh, just like to remind you to subscribe to my channel, like this video if you guys enjoy it, and let's go over our swing trades, huh? Subscribe if you're not a new member. Yeah, so we made seven swing trades in the month of February. Let's get right into it. All right, TBLT Tough Built. So we bought that one right here. It was right around two dollars and seventy-one cents. I would have liked to see this swing trade get up to about four to five dollars. It never did. It just kept on dumping off. So I actually took a little bit of a loss on this one, and I'm sure if you guys were in it, you did too. So on this one, I cut my losses right around ten percent. I wasn't very happy, but you have to know when to cut your losses, and that's how you become a great trader. Is once you learn that. So our next swing trade was ACB, and this occurred on the fifth of February. So I bought in on this dip right here. It was right around seven forty. And I'm still holding this stock as of right now. And then the stock dipped down pretty good right here into the sixes. And I actually bought more and I lowered my average down to 722. And I'm probably going to hold this stock to about $13, $15. Just have to keep an eye on it. All right, our next one's ZNGA, Zingia. And this swing trade occurred on the 10th of February. So I bought in right here. Actually on a good time. I had a nice pullback and it was a good time to get in here right about at 482. And I'm actually going to stay in this stock till the end of the year, like I was saying, because they got some pretty serious games coming out. So if you're still holding this right now, you got about a 10.40% gain on this. That's still very good. All right, now we got NIO Neo, and I made this video on the 14th of February. So I got in right here on a nice little pullback about at 7.43. And I actually sold this stock right before the earnings because I didn't want to be in it, which was a really good call. I mean, it could have went any way, but I actually came out with, see, a 38% increase for the swing trade. And it's a good thing I got out of it because it just dumped after the earnings, after bad news. But I'm actually watching it right now because I'm probably going to have another entry point into this. All right, our next one is OSTKOverstock.com. And I did this video on the 20th of February. Let me zoom in here real quick. So the 20th is right here, if you can see me moving it. And as I said in the video, I was going to wait for a hard pullback on this to buy around $20. And sure enough, it had a nice pullback here. And I actually bought in right around 1838. It was right around the 200 period. I kind of figured I was going to bounce off of that, and it kind of did. But I am still in this swing trade right now. And you see, as of right now, we're at about 11%. I'm going to keep an eye on this one, though. If it does break through the 200 period, I might just get out of this. But this swing trade is still rolling right now. All right, our next one is Hexo, H-E-X-O, and this is a marijuana company. And I did this video on the 26th of February, so the end of the month. And so we don't really have that much time under this swing trade. Let's zoom in right here. So for this swing trade, I actually wanted to buy in around 515, so I put in a buy order on that. And I actually got it filled, so it was very good. And I'm still holding it right now, so I got about an 18% profit on this. So I'm getting close to getting rid of it, but I'm just going to hold on for a little bit more longer. All right, our last one is on the 28th of February, and this is Fitbit, F-I-T. It's a ticker symbol. And I was actually talking about this swing trade on the big dump it had right here. I never got in this, actually, because I didn't like what was playing out. You can see it was bouncing off the 20 period, and I just didn't like how it was looking. So I think we did pretty good with these swing trades. You know, we had a loss here or there, uh, but... You know, yeah, that's going to happen in the stock market, but I think we did pretty good. Just like to remind you to subscribe to my channel, hit the bell so you get the notification on Swing Trades and like this video if you guys enjoyed it. And uh, who wants to make some money out there, huh? I just got out of the hot tub, got crazy hair, huh?